Welcome back to the GEX1. I am the Radio Man 03. We are playing Minecraft on the Xbox One. Great to have you guys ate along again. Been a little while since I had a video. Had a few busy, busy, busy days. Check out the lighting. Now come down around the corner here. This side's just a little bit slower than this side. I've actually slowed this side down quite a bit. I put a, added a bunch of repeaters back in this corner here because these lights were uh, these lights were coming on way before these did, so I had to slow these guys down. But uh, yeah, it looks really good. I love how this turned out. Welcome to episode 19. Glad you stopped by. Boy, I, I meant to, to... Actually, I did record once this week, and the video was just awful. It turned out awful. I just had a heck of a time, so... I did not put it up. Um, Tuesday was real busy at work. Wednesday, I had to go and take my vehicle into the shop. So that, of course, took some time to whoa, to uh, deal with. And uh, Thursday, I recorded, but it had been a long day at work. And uh, the, like I said, the video just came out awful. So I, I, I tossed it. What do you think of that? That looks really sweet. Take a look at this hallway here. You guys have not seen this yet. Uh, we gotta have to do the ceiling as well, but we're gonna hold off on the on the on the top of this until we get uh, kind of the floor figured out up there. But let me sh go ahead and show you what we've got going on here. We did this last video. We had the um, the glowstone going across each of these. Uh, I added glowstone here on the corners too, and kind of wrapped the stair around. And here's the design I came up with for the the hallway here. Now, part of what I want to do in this hallway is I've been adding some of the white snow blocks back in here and they really look good. It gives the wall a really nice little snap to it. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna finish this up. I'm gonna do this first and then we're gonna work on the spider spawner. I have it started. Uh, I've got the water put in and I have the basic uh, box built right now, but I wanna get this taken care of first. I really wanna get this, uh, this hallway all cleaned up and completed in terms of, you know, the, the decoration, the design of it. Let's see, where's that uh, fence right here, boom. Hope you like the design though. I think it turned out really good. I really like it. Um, it it kind of takes us, transforms us back to concrete as we get over here and up into the spawner room. So I think it's going to work out just perfect for us. At first, I was going to do those red, uh, the on and off lights all the way up the stairs. But then once we put the glowstone in here, it was so bright that it didn't make any sense to have that. So I took it out. This is kind of tedious, huh? <laughs> this is a little bit tedious. Yeah, it's really tedious. Tell you what, let me go ahead and get these put in. I'm going to put this on both sides. And I come back and we'll go up and take a look at the spider spawner. All right, that cleans that up. Got our nice white wall back behind here. I thought we'd bring a little white in up into this area of the build. I do like the snow blocks. They're quite nice. Very nice indeed. They got a good texture to them. Uh, so we'll probably bring a little bit of white up into this, this area of the build. Not a whole lot, but like here we're going to see these here because those are actually part of the wall there so we're gonna have to cover those up but this will probably wind up getting slabbed up here anyways but I haven't done a whole lot of progress up here I did dig this back uh, we have slime spawning in our skeleton spawner now <laughs> yeah uh, the whole place down here is the whole thing is just nothing but a slime chunk so here's the skeleton spawner right now all dug out just realized I had my TV volume up too, and that causes an echo when I record, so I wanted to make sure I turn the TV down. But here's the skeleton spawner dugout, and like I said, you know, there's slime spawning all over the place in here now too. They spawn over here in the spider spawner as well. Let me show you kind of where we've gotten with this. Uh, it's just about, it's a block bigger all the way around because I needed eight blocks for the water to flow to the center here, and it works out really nice. They come falling down in here. Uh, if we were just standing here and just letting them go, they would definitely fall down these holes here. I wonder if I put signs if they'd be more apt to fall down the stairs or fall through here. If I put signs along this, would they see that as a block and come down here? I don't know. But I thought what we'll do is we will put um, we'll put cactus all the way around here. And then when they fall down into here, they will, of course, uh, land on the cactus and, and get, you know, beaten up and stuff. Wind up grinding on the cactus and killing themselves. So that's what we're going to do. And then... I've got to figure out what I put on the floor down here, on the floor, and we so we can go up underneath it, because we'll have, eventually, we'll have hoppers down here. And so when they die, the drops will fall into hoppers and into chests down below here. But in the meantime, I think, in order for us to get the drops, I'm wondering if I put a row of fences in the middle area here, they'll land on that and jump around, and then the drops should fall through the fencing, I think. 
and then we can stand down below and just pick those things up that way. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to use this specifically for a string farm. I want lots of string off of it so we can use it for wool. We're going to have a lot of wool in this build. Once we get to the main GE, you know, there'll be a lot of carpet involved. There's already been quite a bit of carpet involved in the build. Um, well, let me, let me kind of take you up here and show you how we got this worked out. So yeah, we're exactly eight blocks all the way around from the center here. So, and then we add an extra block in the corner here. So we bring this water water drop up a little bit. So anywhere they spawn in here now, they will be pushed to the center to, uh, of course, fall down into there. Just did that up there so far. No walls on it yet. I kind of wanted to get the cactus and get, we're going to need some more sand as well. We need cactus and sand in order to uh, accomplish this project because we want to glass this in and make it so we can, we can walk, look through it uh, to see the spiders doing their thing as they, uh, you know, as they fall up there, and then we're going to want to watch down here too, so as they, they grind up. So we've got a pretty fun room, I think, to, to put together. I'm looking forward to building it. And uh, as far as the outer edge, I don't have a whole lot of thought in my head on that yet. I've been just kind of working on getting this to, to work. We had it one block shorter. We had it only seven blocks in. And for some reason, I thought if I put ladders along the edge, the water would stop. But of course, it didn't. It, it traveled over the top, and there was only one little hole right where the spawner is through the water and, and that wasn't going to work so I had to build it one more bigger one more block out so it's eight blocks all the way around away from that center square there and that's going to work out great for what we need we just want them to fall in get washed down and then we uh you know we take their drops we take their stuff from them hope you like the hallway and the tunnel I think they turned out really great in the grand staircase with the black carpet I really love how big and glowy it is up there. It looks really great. I love that. So I hope you like that. And then we got the lights pretty well synced up. I guess I'm not too worried about having them any closer to being synced up right now. Uh, let's go out and get some sand. I wonder what time it is right now. Is it daytime or nighttime? Uh, I'm pretty much collecting XP right now. To uh, We've got to fix uh, our picks. I, I fixed the wrong dang pick with the 30 XP I had. Uh, last episode. I don't know which one I fixed, but it wasn't the one I wanted to. The silk touch is right down here in our inventory. It's the uh, this one right here, second one over. That's the silk touch, and I wanted to fix that, and I I, I don't know what pick I fixed. <laughs> I have no clue. But anyways, we're... Uh, oh, you know what? Um, Let's grab our other sword, the looting three sword, just in case we run into something out there. It's daytime, but I don't know how long it's going to take us to do this. Uh, we have to go out to the desert, which is really just to the south of us. No big deal. But I think if we're out there, if perhaps at night we could find us an Enderman or something, we could uh, do some work on an Enderman. That would be nice to have. Let's get this stuff off the bar as well. Uh, yeah, we're just going out for sand and some cactus. Uh, I should probably have brought the axe, but we're okay. We're okay. So I also delayed these lights a little bit. Take a look. They kind of come on a little bit slower now. I like that. It's a good effect. This way we also have time to get around the corner here. And we can still see the lights coming on while we're walking. Even when we're running, we can, we can manage to do it. So I really like how that turned out. All right, let's go get some supplies so we can get... I want to get the spawner working today. I want to figure out how I, what I need to do to get that to work so I can collect a bunch of string. I'll tell you what, I'm going to head out to the desert and I will meet you out there. Stick around. Desert dead ahead. Grab us a few cactus. Uh, yeah, I'll probably, I'm going to plant them and, and get some to grow downstairs too. I guess we don't have to really do that though. We could just cut a bunch of them down, huh? We'll plant a few back. And then, uh, you know, throw one here and we'll throw one there. <laughs> the rest of them we'll keep. Yeah, I just want the spider spawner to be a, just a grind thing. Just a grinder. So all we do there is we... Just want them for their string. I don't need another XP farm. I have plenty of those. And let's take a couple more. There we go. Excellent. That should be enough, I think. Um, hmm. No, we're going to grab some more, just in case. It's okay. We're gonna, we can put some cactus downstairs just as uh, decoration, too. And let's grab one more. Nice supply of cactus out here, huh? Real nice supply. Okay, let's get a little sand as well. Uh, yeah, we're going to definitely need some sand. 
we're gonna have to glass in that uh, spider spawner and it's, it's big so but it'll be really cool once it's done I think it'll be a lot of fun to be able to stand I want to like the zombie spawner and the skeleton spawner will be real visible too so when we come in we can actually see what's going on I like being able to watch the mobs falling into the trap it's fun Oh, shovel's so great. We'll just grab a few stacks of this. All right, we are heading back. Just up a couple of hills here, and then boom, we are back home. I enjoy cutting through here and just kind of looking at the, 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 the terrain, because I've been downstairs so much that I really don't know the general uh, landscape around us. I know it's extreme hills, but, you know, at the same time, you ask yourself, okay... What am, what am I dealing with as far as the, the land right immediately around me? This looks really cool down here, this little basin. I like that. Um, I'm, I'm actually thinking about doing something right down there in that, that little groove. Because here's the main GE. She's going to be right here. You know, when we come here, it's going to be right here. You know, we're going to be able to see it clear as a bell. It's going to look pretty awesome out there hanging out over that lagoon, I think. Um, but yeah, like I, you know, like we've, we've talked about, we've got to get the, uh, the mine done first, you know? Priorities, priorities. Everything we need for the GE is down there. That's perfect. It's just exactly what we wanted. Uh, snow Golem. Speaking of which, I was using him, of course, to get the snowballs. I tried to build him down below, and he would not uh, produce a snow block uh, downstairs. Didn't matter where I tried to set him up. There was no snow underneath him. Uh, anybody got an idea on that? Because the tunnel that we uh, take him in is, you know... It's just right down here, so it's not like we're in the desert with him, but I could not get the snow golem to produce snow down in the mine. I had to bring him back up to the surface here. Weird. Very strange. So I've got some coffee today. And some uh, some hot cider. Variety's like, we should have some hot cider. And I thought, oh, that's a good idea. It seems like those are the things I only have uh, at Christmas time, like hot chocolate too. I only do that right around Christmas time. I don't even usually do that in the middle of winter, but uh, I don't know, something about it feels just right, you know? Mm-hmm, it surely does. Uh, okay, we've got the cactus and we have sand, so we're good there. Let's go on back down here and see if we can't set up kind of a border around them and uh, have them fall through and get ground up by the sand. We'll see if it works. I hope the spiders don't just sit there and... Um, float like that. I hope they actually fall down here on their own. Huh. Uh, I believe that's three blocks, so what we need to do is actually bring it down. Let's see, right here. Huh, he's not coming down in here. That's weird. What's wrong with him? Oh, that's going to be horrible. There we go. Alright, and here we go, like so. Beautiful. Yeah, yeah. I got the Bane of Arthropods on. Let's take these out here too, I think. Yeah, come on. They're spawning really well up there, and we got quite a bit of light going on too. That's kind of funny how much, how many are actually spawning. Okay, so then the sand is going to go, of course, right along the edge because we want our cactus out here. So when they fall down in here, they jump up and down on them. Take it, spider. They know what's coming. They know what's coming. And then yeah, we can go three high with these, which I like that idea. But it much. One right here, too. Cactus you can't put right next to each other. It won't let you, so we have to do it this way. Oh, you got through there. Clever spider, clever spider. There we go. Excellent. Maybe we'll have this guy right here to be able to. Oh, no, ouch, 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 ouch. <laughs> I cannot stand the cactus. Is he, are they doing that because they can see me? Hmm. Oh, 
Oh yeah, it works great. <laughs> hmm. Okay, we're going to put fence there. I think we're going to put fences there along the bottom of that. And then we should, I think, be able to stand underneath it. Why won't he come after me, though? And they're dropping string. Excellent. All right, let's get uh, let's get some fences. Nether brick fences, I think, would be would be nice in there. Get the nether brick instead of the wood. They they have the same properties, I think, don't they? It should have the same effect. Both fences they kind of raise you up off the ground. Uh, gosh, if that's the case, I wonder if I could use cobblestone fencing in there. Well, let's let's grab the nether brick fence. I think that would be a, a a kind of a nice color in there. Let's do that instead. Let's do that. Let's see what we got here. Uh, we only have ten. We only have ten of them. Ay 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 ay. We got too much stuff on us. Way too much stuff on us. Let's dump these snowballs. Don't need those. Um. Let's get this stuff fired up. We got sand here to cook. Let's go ahead and cook it up. Oh, we got stone in there. We got stone in there. Iron. Gold. Here we go. Let's throw the sand in there. We're going to need the glass for sure. We already talked about that. So what do you guys do to... Uh, what makes you feel like the holidays? What do you do to feel like the holidays are here? Uh, more sand. Excellent. Beautiful. All right, we'll throw the excess right in here, and I'll throw that in later. And we could drop off this slime ball, and then we should have a little a little room in our inventory. We have a string, and we have a uh, uh, spider eye chest down there. Now we pick those up. Let's go ahead and turn those right into blocks right now. Boom, just like that. Okay, now... Ten. Hmm. <laughs> Odds are we are going to have to go back to the nether to get some more nether rack to make some more nether brick. But let's get these in here for now and see what we got. See what we got going on. Lights come on pretty cool right alongside us. Yeah, I love that. That's great. It doesn't come on fast enough while you're running like that, though. It needs to come on a little bit faster. We can work on the timing some more. We have the access to it, so we can we can monkey with that all the time. Now, I think... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight... Oh, we have enough. Beautiful. Now, let's see. if that If that's the case there, let's go down and see what we can do. Oop, what do we got here? Ha <laughs> cave. I knew I know there's a cave down here. There's our stuff built around it all over the place. Okay, and then we want to go in. Uh oh. No 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 no. We We don't want to do that. We don't want to do that. Gonna need that piece of sand back. Let's fix that. There we go. Okay, they seem to be treading water quite a bit there. I don't like that. Should be able to do something like this, I think. Mm-hmm. Is there, st is there drops coming through here? No, they're not. They're right there. You see them? Okay, so those aren't falling through. Do I need this one here? Let's see. Can he fit through that? <laughs> 
See, that's going to be the beauty. We'll put, we'll put hoppers where the fences are right now, and the hoppers will just suck up all this string. <laughs> that's great. But the drops aren't falling to me. Hmm. Oh, you know what? Let's see something real quick. Okay, I can't get up that way. They can't get me here either, can they? <laughs> I don't like the fact that I have to jump. I would rather the drops just fall through here. So let's think about that. Um, how would I make it so that they would just come through here and fall right into, into my lap? Hmm, that's really cool though. I like that. I do. That's pretty cool. They can't, they can't touch me here. Okay, it's gonna work, that, that's for sure. But I need to figure out this part right here. What is it that I do, what do I put here to make it so I can stand down here and all the drops fall through? Maybe that's just not gonna be the case right now. I bet we'll even lose some, even with hoppers, because the string will fall on those side pieces of sand there. And there's not much we can do about that, I don't think. But uh, it shouldn't be that bad, right? Now they can see me, so they're trying to get me really bad, but obviously they can't. I'm really surprised they can't do that. Yeah, this is going to work just great. What I'd also like, you know what else we should see is if, if I'm out there, but still in range, will they, will they continue to fall in here, or will they just sit there and tread water like they were doing? Let's let's do that. Let's go on out of here. Yeah, let's go out. Let's see what we got. We're going the right way. Nope. This is all the 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 work going on back in here. Look at this stuff, huh? Been busy, 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 busy guy. Where the heck am I? Boop. <laughs> back in the hall. <laughs> I've been trying to light up that those caves back in there as best I can. And we had to seal up a bunch of stuff too, so you know, there's always that. Let's see now. Let's see if these guys will I guess once they fall in there, they're gonna see me and they're gonna wanna do they're gonna wanna kill me. See, they can see me through the glass, I think. He sees me, so he's just trying to come after me. So whatever I do, it's gonna have to be underneath here. No, he should come right through us, right to us, huh? Yeah. So, okay, we're going <clears> to... <throat> we'll build our view chamber here. And I'll think about what I need to do about these ladders here. So let me give it a... Let me give the whole thing some more thought. And then I'll come back and we will carry on with uh, getting this thing enclosed. Oh, yeah. Come on, Slammers. Look at them all. Working real nice. So I got to thinking, maybe signs and water would be a better choice there. And maybe that'll allow the uh, the spiders to hit the water, but they'll jump up. I hope they jump up and don't try to drown, you know. And then still get killed in the cactus and then the drops will fall through the water to us below. I'm thinking maybe that'll work. I don't know. We'll have to see. Oh yeah, Look at this hall. I love it be down here a lot that's for sure well but, but you know like i said there's gonna be a lot of wool and string and carpet and stuff like that so this is going to be a huge huge help for us big time okay um get rid of these and then we're going to do some signs here no 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 not here there. Oh. Okay, get out. Get out. 
<laughs> Sword, please. Thank you. Panic, sheer panic. Like that. And we're going to need them in the middle, too. Oh, for Pete's sake. Okay, there we go. And then we need we need one in the middle. Okay, so now we should be able to put our water here. Here. And here. And that's going to push us... That pushes us over here. Let's see if the drops come this way when the spiders fall in here. I'm curious about it. I'm very, very curious. Oh, look at all the good stuff down here. This is great. It's working. I think I'm too far away now, aren't I? Is it telling me I'm too far away right now because it's uh, not producing any spiders? Let's just close up a little area here for us to test this out. Put some torches up. There we go. Okay, yeah, I must have been too far away there. Hmm. Now he's fighting the current. Does he does not see us? Hmm. Oh wow, he came right through the water, didn't he? Okay, that's not gonna work. <laughs> that does not work. Okay, back to the signs. Or back yeah, back to the Okay, now that one is. He's just... Okay, now that one fell straight through, so... Why did the other one not fall through? The water's not deep enough, maybe? But if we go any further down, I don't think the, 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 we're going to be within range of the spawner. So I don't want to do that. So we'll probably go back to the fences... And then, once the hoppers get here, the problem is, though, if we go back to the fences, then I can't just set my controller down and walk away and let it go. See, now, he got kind of hung up on the, on, a, on the edge of the sand and the cactus there. We got the drop on that one. Hmm. I, boy, I don't know. I don't know. Um... what to do here about this. I think I'm going to go back with the ladders because this is not a sure thing. They're just... Yeah, like that one there, he's, he's dropping through, so... And then that one doesn't because he gets up on that... just the edge of that sand and sits there. Hmm. Sure is fun to work these puzzles out. Um, yeah, I'm going to go back with the ladders and I think I'm going to put the floor right here so I can stand and have them right above me like that. And then when they die, I'll just have to make sure I'm here and uh, pick up the string. It's worth it right now. We're up to 17 string already. And I guess they're dropping eyes too. I didn't think they did when they just died this way. I thought you had to kill them and get the eyes, but it doesn't look like that's the case. Yeah, you were gonna, he, he would have fallen right through into me. Oh, I guess I have been killing some with the sword, haven't I? So that's why I've got the eyes on me. They do only drop string when they, they grind themselves to death like that. Um, okay, yeah, let's go ahead and put the fences back in. Uh, let me know if there's, if there is a better way to do that. In terms of being able to stand underneath here and pick up the drops like this. So we're going to have to put a nice little, uh, staircase coming down into here. Uh, so we can access this area. So we'll do that for sure. Uh, we might as well... Oh, boy, you know, I'm going to take all that sand out and rework it again, too, because the sand is in the wrong spot. Yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. We're going to set it up for just like this. I love the fact that they can't get to me, and I'm, like, right here next to them. That's so cool. Well, we can put the walls on this and uh, get the outside of this trap cleaned up and looking good. And then all that will be left for this is to, to make this little room here and get the um, uh, figure out how we want the main room around the spawner to look. Come on, up you go. That's not too bad. But yeah, these guys can definitely see me through the glass. They're yeah, they're looking at me. They're so the only place, the best place to be is right in the trap. So they just come straight to you there. 
hurting myself with the cactus. All right, let me take another little break here, and we will get um, a few things put together, and uh, we'll come back and work on the the walls of the uh, the uh, spider spawner, our string farm. We need to put some legs on this thing, so I'm kind of working out just a simple little leg right now to get her get her standing on her own, and we're coming out like so. Actually extending it out just a little bit. If we go too close, then it just doesn't look quite right. So let's go like that, and then like that, and like that. Let me bring this one here, and this one here, and then a slab right on the corner. Boom, like that. Now we can do a little something in here as well, and add some more, uh, some more design to it. In order to do that, though, we do have to pull this out one. And then we can take these all the way up to the ceiling as well if we want to. Oop, wrong one. Wrong way. Yeah, that's gonna work. I am not putting you in correctly. There you go. Just like a so. Okay, perfect. Just like that. Excellent good stout legs on it, right? Because we're going to be up underneath this thing uh, because that's where the kill chamber is going to have to be. It's just right underneath it, so uh, we're going to want to make sure we're down there because I want to do glass. We definitely want to make this glass. He's going to come flying over the top of that onto me. Yep, there he is. There he is. <laughs> Crazy spider. There we go. All right. Excellent. Um, this block here, we could swap out for something else. Let's, uh, I got an idea for this right here. Uh, let's, get, let's get these out of here right now, too. Those are going to confuse me. Those are the stairs. We don't want those in here. Come on, spider. There you go. Uh, let's go back, let's see, do I have, I do have some cobble on me, so let's do, let's get some cobble fences here. So we have some cobble on us, and we have so much of it, <laughs> tons of it. Uh, let's start by, um, taking this out of here. Something like that, oh boy, that, no, that, that really makes it look a lot weaker. I don't like that. Those legs don't look strong enough to me if we do that, so let's go ahead and do that instead. Um, we can't put this here, can we? No, it's going to be in the way. Okay, well, let's let's go along here real quick. Um, I think I'm going to start with a solid block first. Let's go one, two, something like that. Spiders are good swimmers, aren't they? Is that going to work out, though? I don't know if we... I don't know. I didn't measure this out. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we come up with here. There's the block right here. Uh, and then we're going to go one, two, fence. Ah, boy. Hmm. Let me work this out. I'll come back. You, you get the idea, though. We're going to do a pattern like that along here. So, uh, let me work this out. Alright, we have to go every three. Three stairs, and then put in a fence. Which is cool. It gives it a real beefy look to it, I think. And I'm going to drop it down with a slab underneath it to just kind of create that trim on there. So we got a nice little different design going on in here. So we're going to need a block here. Nope, wait a minute. That would be incorrect. We are taking these out of here. So, one back. One, two, three. One, nope. Two, three. One, two, three. One. My Elgato is, I think, causing me some trouble when I record. It seems to freeze me up a little bit. 
every now and again. Especially if I've been playing for a couple hours, it starts to act really weird and uh, the sound goes out. And I've explained this before, so if you ever see a weird cut in the video, sometimes that's exactly what it is. It's just that everything freezes up, my controller dies, and it's really unusual. But it happens on a regular basis. And it doesn't seem to help if I back out and save and just back out of the game completely and then reload it. It doesn't seem to help at all. It's just when I'm recording with the Elgato, so it's it's doing something weird while I'm uh, while I'm playing here. Wrong one. There we go. And then we're gonna work on the uh, the top half. I want to get these guys boxed in so they stop falling off the edge on me. I'm tired of them coming after me. Come on, buddy. We're gonna need more stairs. One, two, three. Space. Let's go get some more. Let's go ahead and take these blocks out of here first. We're gonna need these to make some stairs with. Dun 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 dun. Yeah, this is a nice big giant room, huh? Come to the top of the stairs. And what we'll also do here is we will, once I get this figured out, we're gonna do some kind of a entryway here. Hopefully. I can work out some kind of a nice uh, big grand entrance to that room. I think that would be pretty cool. So let's do that. That should be enough to get us what we need, I think. All right, they're dying in there. I like I like the fact that that works. And once we have the hoppers, we get the hopper update, it's going to be really nice, you know. We'll be able to just put hoppers down there and stand down there and just let them, boom. They'll just constantly fall through. It'll be great. It will be absolutely perfect. We'll have a nice, nice string farm. Lots of string will be coming our way. Oh, boy. Yep. Yep, yep. And yep, yeah, there we go. Excellent. <clears throat> so what do you guys want for Christmas anyways? I want a copy of uh, Grand Theft Auto V. I've played the other ones. I didn't like Grand Theft Auto IV. I just didn't care for uh, Nico. I didn't care for that character. Uh, so I, I didn't play. I got a little ways into it and I just lost interest. But this one here, Variety had the uh, Xbox 360 version. And I uh, played with her a little bit on it. And it looked like a lot of fun. I played the other ones. I uh, played all of them, except, like I said, the fourth one. I just, I don't know, something about it just bothered me. I didn't care for it. But this one looks really great. Very, very cool. So I'm looking forward to playing some of that. And I think I want to get a copy of Destiny as well. I wouldn't mind playing Destiny and trying that out and play the campaign a little bit and see how that turns out. Oh, that looks great. I like that. Let's go ahead and just, um, let's just seal those those corners up. We may not do anything extra with these. I don't know. I have to look and see. You know, you get a room going like this. You get quite a bit of it done. And then there's always ways to come back and, and look at it again. And like I said, we do those remodel videos. We did a few on the GE71. Uh, hey, Spider. That's right. Come over and get me. Come on, guys. This is where you want to be. Right here. Beautiful, beautiful. That's what I'm talking about right there. Excelente. That's working perfect. That's going to be perfect. Absolutely perfect for us. We'll do a lot of good things with that. Excellent. All right, now let me look at the uh, the outside of it, and we'll figure out where we're going to go from here next. All right, we are back. I am uh, putting glass walls up and around the edge. I just kind of want to get this sealed off before we, we go too, too much further. I'm, I'm not liking being knocked around by the spiders on a regular basis here, so I'm just kind of putting up. I raised the bottom of this up one, so I added one more row of brick onto here. And then I want to get this, I just want to get this encased because they are uh, climbing up and constantly knocking me off of here. So that is where I'm at right now. And then I think we're probably going to have to build some kind of a catwalk on this one too so we can come up around the edge and take a look. But if they can see us, there's really no point in having that. So I think I'm just going to make this look really neat with the glass. And then we're going to want to always be, when we're in here, we're going to be up underneath the trap. Because you can see they're, they're just, uh, they're a pain. <laughs> they're so loud, too. It's one of the few Minecraft sounds I don't care for, is the spider. 
Bingo. We're just going around and uh, filling up the glass, and then we're putting one more block up right now. Just all the way around the edge here. That'll seal us up real nice, and then we can go on, carry on from there. Uh, I've got one too many I can't reach. <laughs> it's working so well down there, too. And I got torches and everything up. <laughs> Doesn't seem to slow them down at all. That's mostly due to the fact that the whole thing is pretty dark down there. The trap itself. You see how well they work with, with even some light in here? They, you really don't have to have it pitch black. Oh, tell me I got more blocks. Ooh, we are out of materials to make bricks. So I will uh, have to run back to storage. Uh, we want to take these out so we can get past here. If we do something like that, hmm, hmm, it's not too shabby to give it some uh, some different shape up there on just on the corners something like that yeah give those corners a little uh, should we put one here yeah I think so add another one here like that bring those corners down uh, right there it's not the easiest one to, to snap onto. Okay, yeah, that's correct. Okay. We do it on each of these corners. That's going to look nice. No, we want that upside down. It's not the right way. Nope. Still not the right way. All those spiders are loud, huh? Still not going the right way. Doggone it. Stubborn. There we go. Yeah, I like that. Okay, that's going to work just fine. Let's get these blocks back. There we go. Oh boy, the spiders are loud. Let me get these finished up and we'll, uh, we'll take a look at them together. Alright, I think it's, uh... It's come together pretty good. Corners are looking really heavy and sturdy. A nice trim down here at the bottom of the, the structure. I don't know that I'm going to put anything up up top. Let me know. Um, we could add some things up on top, but I don't know that it's really, really necessary. We've got our brackets right here. I mean, we could do like an upside down stair there and maybe do a kind of an upside down stair bracket around the edge of these corners all the way around. That might kind of finish it off a little bit. We'll try one of those over here at the very start, but... Uh, yeah, uniform all the way around. I like this. Then we've got this big entranceway here, and what we'll do is we'll carve this out and uh, maybe make it just so we can walk down uh, in a square around this room here and just have staggered steps that go down underneath where we'll be for the uh, kill chamber and work it out like that. I think that would work out perfect for our purposes. And then we'll make sure that we can just get up in here. And, uh, boom, there we go. We'll knock those torches out, of course. Probably clean up that ceiling a little bit. Maybe, maybe not. Don't know. The concrete look is really good. I like that. I like the stone, the way it looks. But uh, I think this is going to serve our purposes pretty good. We've got quite a bit of string already. I think we've got about four stacks. <clears throat> not all from just now, but um, we've got about four stacks of uh, string going on here. Uh, yeah, but you can see they're going to get stuck out on the sand a little bit too. That's going to be something that's going to uh, gonna happen here. That's great. Yeah, that's perfect. That'll work out just fine. All right, let's try the uh, let's try the idea I had with the stairs here real quick. We need to. We only have three stairs left, so let's make a few more of those before we go all the way up there. And boom, like so. I'm talking about these posts right here on the corners, huh? All 
All right. Yes, we want to go. Is that going to give it to me? I don't know. That's going to actually let me put this one the right direction here. Like so. And like so. And we want to go like this. And let's bring this dirt out. And there. And there. Hmm, that might be looking a little too heavy. We'll take a look and see, though. We'll take a look and see if we like that or not. Uh, hmm. Yeah, you know what? That might not be bad. That might not be too bad. Let's do that. Kind of square it up and uh, even, even it out with the bottom here. Uh, like this. There we go that and like that. There we go. Perfect. A few more of those. And one there and one there. Yeah, that should even out the weight. Distribute our weight a little bit here through here. Let's take a look. Let's take a step back. Oh yeah. Okay, that takes that takes the, the, the size of these legs all the way to the top. Although it also makes me want to do something like this down here, you know, something that makes it look more solid. We're going to have to slab this floor anyways because we do have uh, slime spawning in here. So it'll be a small entryway there, but it'll be cool. Yeah, oh, actually we can't even get through there. Look at that. <laughs> I didn't realize that was going to happen. We'll have to figure something out. I just don't want slime spawning in here. Maybe we'll do that. We'll slab the rest of it and we'll do something in here to keep the mobs from spawning uh, up underneath here. But, uh, yeah, that looks good. I like that. All right, I'm going to finish those up all the way around. And, um, you know, just kind of mull this over a little bit more in my head. And the next video, I guess, it we'll do is we'll have this, uh, we'll get this thing wrapped up, this uh, spider spawner. And then we'll get the skeleton spawner wrapped up. And once it's done, then we can wrap our room around it. And then that'll take care of our, our spawner, uh, our spawner area here. Uh, we'll have a really cool looking room all the way through here. Hope you enjoyed the video. Like, comment, subscribe, and share. Have an awesome, fantastic day. I'm the Radio Man 03, and I will talk to you again next time.